Modern is the, it's founded in 1990 here in the UAE. It's the largest single source supplier of plant and equipment rental to multiple industries including oil and gas, construction, marine and most notably events. Um, again, on this event, the, uh, the job is that of a full turnkey project management and delivery of the event alongside the Falcon Golf Management people. So we take care of all of the infrastructure. Um, you may recall some time ago they had chalets here that used to uh, adorn the 18th. That is no longer. We now work with our partners in Arena, a great team of people who give us that beautiful chalet that we now have there. So everything else that you see in terms of infrastructure on the course, all the recorders' cabins, all the lights in the car park, uh, all of the uh, sanitation facilities, we do end-to-end -end in all of that and provide all the services and people to support it. Yeah, I mean, when we think about that and we go back to the, the very start, which I remember uh, the very earliest days in the, in the 90s, it was nothing like what it is now, obviously, and Dubai was nothing like what it is now. But it's just gone from strength to strength over the years. And, you know, full credit to the people in Falcon Golf Management for the job they do today and the people who, who preceded them in the roles of running the, the, uh, the tournament. It's just, it's improved dramatically. It's gone from strength to strength. It's probably, you know, one of the best tournaments in the region. Uh, without any question. I guess when I came to Dubai, um, the tallest building was the, uh, the Trade Centre on Sheikh Zayed Road. So if you can imagine going from that um, and having the golf tournament here in Emirates, in Emirates Golf Club over the years, the backdrop that we see now when the televisions pan across was nothing like what it was even, um, say, 15 years ago. So it's changed dramatically. It's um, it's, it's a thing we always say that it's strange when you're in your own city or your home city and you still have to put on Google Maps to find your way around. It's always, it's always the city of dreams. It certainly has been the city of dreams for so many people and those who have come, up, come over to pursue careers in whatever the industry was, whether it was the construction industry or financial services, whatever it is, Dubai has got this broad base of industries that has attracted some of the best talents in the world. And truthfully, it remains the city of dreams. And I don't think that dream is over by a long shot. I think we're going to hear a lot more about Dubai as we go forward.